What's up guys and welcome back to Sunlight Network. In today's video, it's a bit of a different video in today's one, we're going to be talking about the Maccas 50 years glass that everyone is going psycho about basically online. If you check out eBay and pretty much Google one of these glasses, you can make anything from $20. Um, for these glasses if you've got a certain one, okay, so there's a few very popular ones But they're really cool collectibles. You can open them. You can um, you can open them and use them if you want We can just collect them now. I'm gonna open them obviously and show you we've got two here Basically I'll show you a little bit about them You can buy them and basically we'll tell you exactly how long you can buy them for because it is very limited time only So they are pretty cool. So if you want to buy these so a particular glass just like this, this is what they look like open So if you just want to buy one of these they are $4.40 each now I do find sometimes you have issues buying these in store. So pretty much if you uh, if you can't buy them in store, what you can do if you've got Uber, if you're making an order on Uber with Maccas, you can actually order one of these as an add-on add -on for $4.40. So they are pretty cheap for a glass. They are pretty premium glass for $4.40. There are a few interesting things about it, a few claims that Maccas puts um, through and one of them is gonna be this little bump. We're gonna talk a little bit about at, um, at the end of the video. So first of all, how do we get one of these Macca's glasses? So pretty much all you gotta do is order the Mac Junior. You can order the Grand Big Mac, the Big Mac, or obviously the Double Big Mac. All you have to do is make sure that meal is a large meal and you'll get that for absolutely free. That's one great thing, that's how you get the glasses, absolutely free if you get a large meal. It'll be an add-on for free, I'm right there, so that, that's awesome, you don't have to pay for it. However, if you don't want to get a large meal or you don't want to get a Big Mac, you just want to buy them separately, you can ask McDonald's to add them on, it'll just be $4.40 each, that's how much they do cost, okay? And you do have, uh, you can't buy too many, you can only buy a selected amount when you go there, I think the minimum is two, um, especially online, especially on Uber Eats and stuff, I believe there is a minimum, so yeah, you won't be able to buy heaps of them, and if you do, just say you go on Uber Eats and buy like five, you might find yourself getting five of the same one so keep that in mind too so they are very interesting so what we want to basically show you now is pretty much we we'll talk to you guys about the meals um, basically you need now obviously these are limited but also some of the meals are so what is going to be limited time so you're going to have the Mac Junior it's going to be expiring in August so I love the Mac Junior it is a brand new burger I absolutely love it it's a small little burger not as big as the Big Mac still delicious burger it's so sad that will be getting removed in August obviously the Grand Big Mac also I tried that one too great burger sad that's going to be getting removed again in August as well, same as with the glasses, they'll all be getting removed in August. However, the uh, remaining burger will um, remain as the Big Mac and the double Big Mac will remain there. Um, but if um, the Mac Junior and the Grand Big Mac are super popular, let's just hope Maccas does keep them because I'm really happy with the Mac Junior and obviously the Grand Big Mac, they're awesome burgers right there. Now let's show you a little bit about the glass, what everyone is on the hype about. So let's show you them and pretty much show you a few different things with them and a claim that McDonald's claims, which we're going to actually test out. Let's go show you all about that right now. Hi guys, so these are the glasses that I've picked up at McDonald's. Now, if you are a collector, you can pick these up on Gumtree, eBay, but be expecting to pay around 20 bucks, because that's what I notice um, a lot of them are. But if you're not a collector, and you are picking these up at Macca's, you are sort of gonna make quite a bit, bit of a sale, because these are $4 if you buy them at McDonald's, and you can pretty much sell them for 20 bucks and people actually buy these things, which is quite amazing. I didn't think so many people would actually buy them, but they do, especially if you're a collector. Now, I'm not a collector, I'm just gonna put it in the cupboard, but these glasses are pretty cool. So this is one of them already open. Now, as you see, you can't set it up like this. It will automatically do this. Now, what McDonald's claims is this will not spill. They do note at the back of it, always, um, when you're pouring a glass, make sure you do it carefully so you don't spill it. But when this is full, full of liquid or whatever you put in there, like um, any sort of drink, apparently this will not spill. Now that's very interesting, which we are gonna actually test out in a little bit, um, just to test that theory out. Not sure what the camera's doing right there. Um, but as you see, you can like do that, uh, all that sort of stuff, and yeah. As you see, it does not tip over. So their claim might be right, but we'll check it out very soon. Now this one right here, we'll just wait for that to stop spinning, is the drink. Right there, so that's the drink version. Now I'm not too sure what's in this one. I think it's a burger. I do remember pulling it out. It is a, I think that's fries. I don't know what that is actually. Yeah, I actually don't know what that is. If you know what that is, guys, let us know in the comments what the heck that is. What is that supposed to be? 
I'm thinking... Nah, it's not fries. I don't know what that is. Um, you've got to let us know down below. What the heck is this? I want the burger one. I really want to get that collectible burger one. Even though I'm not going to collect it, it'll look cool in the cupboard. I want to get the um, burger one. That'd be really cool. But I have no idea what that is. I didn't really think about it before. For some reason, I thought I had the burger one, but I don't. Um, I don't know what that is. Um, so as you see, um, we'll be able to fill these up. So pretty much as I showed before, uh, yeah, they do not sit um, up like a normal glass. And apparently, if you have this full of liquid, they will not, um, obviously, um, fall over, which is quite interesting, their claim. <laughs> well, we're going to see how true that is. Hopefully, we're not making too much mess, but as you see, when you do do that, they do seem to go back, which is, their claim is actually correct. So, apparently, you will not be able to, uh, these obviously will not tip. Um, now, where I read this tip is actually not on this. It's actually on the McDonald's website, by the way, but you can read this if you want. Pretty much tells you where the glasses come from and so on. And that's pretty much... Um, well, you know, oh, yeah, and obviously, it's not microwave safe. So, you cannot microwave these, by the way. I read the back of the box. Yeah, you cannot microwave these glasses. And you wouldn't want to microwave them anyway. So, I don't see um, yeah, why you would be doing that. So, let's go fill these up and see if we can actually spill them. Now, hopefully, we don't spill them because going by the McDonald's website, as I said before, these cannot spill. Now, they only say be careful while pouring, but other than that, these cannot spill. Let's go test out that theory. Alrighty, guys. So, we've got some drink right here and let's go see if these will spill. Let's do this carefully. Now, don't do this ridiculously if you're doing this at home because obviously, if you do put enough force or do something ridiculous, Yes, you are going to spill the drinks. So let's just pour this very carefully. Now, you're meant to hold the glass. This is not a good ex They do say to hold the glass. So what I just did was just, don't do what I just did. Hold the glass like that so you don't spill it. Now in theory, if I let go of this glass, it should not tip over, which it doesn't. Which is, um, yeah. So as you see right here, you can both hold them up and they will not tip over. Okay, so what is it we spin on? Okay, let's try that. No, does not tip over. So, okay, McDonald's was 100% correct. Um, right, with that, let's just put a more powerful spin. You know what? Very well done. They do not spill. So if you had soda in there, it's not going to spill. Just obviously don't uh, pull it like this and not hold the glass because obviously you are going <laughs> to spill whatever you're trying to pour into the glass. But other than that, they do not spill. The only thing that I'd be wary of, if you don't have any sort of liquid or drink inside the glass, don't put it on the edge of the counter because they do tend to roll and they spin a little and you'll probably smash a collectible glass. So obviously don't do that. So yeah, that's pretty much the experiment that I really wanted to push through today. And pretty much that obviously was, yeah, the testing if it can spill, tip over, which it can't, will not tip over. Um, obviously the limited edition, so the six to collect, make sure you do that before August. So you get all of July to really get your collection up. If you're not a collector, sell them on eBay. Honestly, you'll make 20 bucks. So that is something really to take advantage of right there. Or just do what I'm doing, whack them in the cupboard. Um, they're really cool glasses. I'm really happy with them. And hopefully this summer we'll get the Coca-Cola ones. I know last year, HJ's I think um, got the Coca-Cola deal with the glasses. Hopefully McDonald's jumps into that one this year and we'll get the collectible McDonald um, glasses. But yeah, that's pretty much all everything I wanted to say. And remember, I believe um, unless we get an update from McDonald's, because this is what I found out obviously from the um, Facebook, McDonald's Facebook, and they said it's everything's expiring. Pretty much all the um, new, um, obviously Big Macs are expiring in August and pretty much the glasses are expiring in August as well. Alrighty guys, so thanks again for watching. If you found it helpful, let us know down below. And we'd love to hear, before you leave, we want to know what glass you want. And we also want to know, I think it was this one. No, this one. What is this glass? You've got to tell us down below. What the heck is it? What does this represent? Let us know all down below. I have to know. Um, so yeah, let us know all about that. And we'll catch you guys next time. Thanks everyone for watching.